Unraveling Idioms, Understanding, Ropes and Hello, language enthusiasts. Today, we're going to explore the meaning and use of the phrase, ropes end. This idiom might tie you in knots if you take it literally, but don't worry, we're here to untangle its meaning for you. Rope's end is an idiom that originates from the times of wooden ships and iron men. Historically, it refers to a short length of rope that was used for flogging, a form of punishment at sea. Nowadays, when someone is at the end of their rope, it means they have reached the limit of their patience, resources, or abilities. It's not about a physical rope but rather a metaphorical one representing the end of one's endurance. Let's look at some examples to see how rope's end is used in everyday language. When the continuous noise from the construction site caused Jenna to lose her focus, she exclaimed, I am at my rope's end with this racket. After hours trying to solve a complex problem, the math student sighed, I'm at the end of my rope. I just can't figure this out. In both cases, rope's end signifies a point of exhaustion or frustration. Understanding synonyms can expand your vocabulary. Here are a few. At wit's end, running out of patience, on one's last leg, fed up. Each of these expresses a similar sentiment to being at rope's end. And that's a wrap on rope's end. Hopefully, you're not at the end of your rope with English idioms. Keep practicing, and soon you'll have them tied down. Remember, learning a language is a journey. Sometimes you might feel like you're walking a tightrope, but the view from the top is worth it. Happy learning!